Let's write the fraction 5 over 100 as a decimal. And there's two ways you could do this. You can take this 5 divided by 100 on your calculator, and that would give you 0 0.05. So 0 0.05, that's equivalent. That's equal to 5 over 100. The other way you could do this is divide 5 by 100 longhand. So you could say you have 5, and you want to know how many times 100 goes into 5. So if we put 0 in a decimal point, we can call it 50. But 100 doesn't go into 50 again. So let's put 0 again, and we'll move over another decimal place, add 0 here. Now we have 500. We know that 5 times 100, that's 500. And we don't have any remainder. So when we divide 5 by 100, we get 0 0.05. And that's the same thing we got before. You can check your work. 0 0.05 times 100, that'll give you 5. This is Dr. B. Thanks for watching.